So David, I always tell my clients that identify who you are, what's your values before applying to any job. So in your opinion, is there any things that they can do to identify those values and why it's important to know who you are? Yeah, so I give five daily practices to identify not only the values, uh, but who you are and what you want and how to get it and to live inspired or in theos, enthusiastic with it. Uh, and those five daily practices, I'd be happy to give to everyone. Just email me, david at dmelzer.com. The first is you have to every day take inventory of what you want according to your mid and long-term objectives. So if you know what you want today, according to my mid and long-term objectives of what I want personally, experientially, giving and receiving wise, I then can move to the second daily practice of who I can help and who can help me. The third practice to be a student of our calendar, to pay attention to and give intention to the activity we have planned, the activity we don't have planned and our sleep. That allows us the fourth daily activity to prioritize what's important to us, not what's urgent. Urgency is a subset of importance. If you know the what, the who, the how, and the now, you can apply your why. You will live in spirit, inspired. You will enjoy the consistent, persistent pursuit of your potential. The five daily practices are the key to being happy, the key to utilizing these days effectively by knowing your what, your who, your how, your now, and applying your why. And the key point is persistence because sometimes we start and we got tired and we don't continue and to, to reach our goals, right? Exactly. Nobody ever gets there if they quit. So you need to enjoy the consistent, persistent pursuit of your potential and it will aggregate and compound upon itself. You'll accelerate at such speed and accumulate at such uh, amounts. You won't even imagine how successful you can be. Those are great tips, David. I really enjoyed that. And tune in tomorrow, guys, for my final question with David.